600 rounds. Uh, they were finally taken down at the end by the LAPD SWAT team. But I can tell you this, if I sat there behind the engine block hearing, hearing AK-47 rounds whiz by all of us, uh, I was praying. I don't know about the other cops around me. I mean, there I am with my little pea shooter, my little shotgun, you know, behind my engine block. And we're hearing everything on the radio because we can hear all the shooting on the radio. We can hear, I mean, it's only a mile away, so we can hear everything. And we hear all the communication on the radio. So I, what would I say to a cop out there in a situation like that? Hey, guys, your bulletproof vest is a good thing wearing, but I'll tell you one thing. You better be right with God. Be in a state of grace because, uh, you know what, you guys are, are, are in a very dangerous position. And uh, you, guys, uh, you guys are the only thing that keep us from... Uh, from these monsters in society, but uh, many of these officers have sacrificed their life. In fact, more cops have died in 2017 than in the last 30 years. And so, what would I tell my fellow officers out there? Okay, get back to your faith. Call Jesus into your heart. Pray before you go on duty. Train, work out. Uh, don't be a drinker, don't be a smoker, stay in shape. Stay close to God, love your family, and uh, may, realize this, that life is short and make every moment count. When we come back, you're not going to want to miss Mike McCartney. He's a SWAT instructor in Arizona. He's got some interesting things to say to us. You're listening to the Terry and Jesse Show. We'll be back in a moment.